It has been a very interesting life. <laughs> Unfortunately, there's been a lot of really hard things, like our parents got divorced, and then my mom got cancer. She had cancer for three years, and then she passed away. I mean, he lost his mom. It's so sad, and I think we really just had to cling to each other, like as a family and as siblings, like just kind of picking each other up when we were having hard days and things like that. Having to just grow up from such a young age, like doing my laundry, cooking my food at night, and like trying to get a job just to help out my dad as much as I can. But like that just made me who I am today. And like it just made me grow up as a man at such, such a young age. I know it was hard on him and it still is, you know, to this day. But uh, he loves his mom and would. He would do. really anything, just to have, have another day with her. My mom was the best. She was so fun and she just loved all of us. She wanted to take every moment with us and a lot of that looking back on pictures and memories and stuff was with Mason because he was a baby. It was a really special relationship. Sometimes it's hard for me to remember some things, but I mean, since I was the baby of the family, like I, I remember some things and just like me and her were super close, but I feel like even now that we're even closer. I think she's behind every decision that he makes because he, he wants to make her proud. And I think he puts everything out there and not even just football, but everything he does because he wants to be his best self and just really live life. And I'm, I'm sure it's because of her. Right when it happened, like I just had so many people ask me questions like how I am. So I just kind of like kept it inside. Like I just wanted to keep it between me and her, but I still wanted to show that I love her. And high school was kind of subtle with like little things like after I'd score a touchdown, I'd just point up to the sky. Well, it could be dangerous. That's Algier in motion into the backfield. Wilson. And he told me, he's like, Coach, I, I want to do this and, and honor my mom. I said, perfect, go do it. Get in the end zone and, and let's see it when you when you pull that shirt down and you, you honor your mom that way. I think that'd be something really cool. I just wanted to get the word out there and just show how much she means to me and that I love her each and every day and like I try to make her proud. And it was uh, kind of an emotional moment for him and for the tight ends in the room because we know how much his mom means to him. To see him on the field, I feel super proud because I know he's worked so hard. That first time that I saw him run out on the field at the Tennessee game, I, I, I literally lost it. I started, you know, start crying and I was just so proud of him. Sometimes like when I do things, like he's even like more proud, like he's more excited. I'm like, how are you more excited than me? Like I just scored my first touchdown and he's like crying and like, Call me after the games, like I knew this was this would happen. From like those little peewee days, like when he's just teeny tiny and it you can't even believe that they can carry the pads themselves because he's so small and then now he's playing for BYU, which is just a dream come true for him, just to play at the college level and it's it's really cool and it makes me feel really proud and really emotional that he's come so far because he's worked really, really hard for it. My dad just challenged me to run hills every day, to lift every single day, like to put lifting over hanging out with friends or doing other things. Growing up, we didn't have a lot of money and I just felt like I had to do it. I took that seriously and that's why I felt like I did all I could and I still wasn't on scholarship, but I took it to heart. I need this for me. I need to be on scholarship just to like help out with my family. That was just my driving force to earn that scholarship. When a scholarship opened up, it was easy to see that he's a guy that deserved it. One day, I just remember him saying that I'm on scholarship, and like I just like went and sat in my car, and I just felt like this weight lifted off my shoulders to not have to worry about all the other stuff. He earned a he earned a scholarship by what he did um, on the field, so I'm pretty sure she's she's proud of what he's doing. It's just the beginning, you know. I mean, you're living out your dream, you're living out my dream, and it's been fun to share it with you.